Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Megan Rissica and I'm a fashion and lifestyle vlogger and today I'm headed to Trader Joe's and it's been a long time, like a month, since I posted any videos and I'm getting back to it. I need to take a little break and yeah, I'm back to vlogging and making videos. So let's get started. So if you've watched my hauls before, I typically do the refrigerated and freezer items first and then move into the items that don't have to be refrigerated just because I'm kind of like unpacking everything and putting things um, in my freezer and refrigerator as we go. So let's start with the refrigerated items and then we'll move to freezer and then we'll do uh, um, the non-refrigerated items. So the first item that I got, which is a new to me item, is the Elote Chopped Salad Kit, which I am super excited about. There is something from the freezer section <laughs> that I'm going to um, use on top of this salad that I'll show you when we get to that point. So I got that. I got the delicious Chopped Salad Kit, which I'm excited about. Um, moving over to some vegetables. So I got um, guacamole. That's for tonight's dinner that I'm going to show you. Baby broccoli. Um, sangria tomatoes. I use this for the TikTok pasta. I also got borzen, which I use for the TikTok pasta, along with the Mediterranean um, feta cheese. This all is kind of for the TikTok pasta. I also use a little bit of heavy whipping cream um, in the TikTok pasta, just kind of like cream it up, you know. Um, I got sweet Italian style chicken sausage. Again, I use this for the TikTok pasta just to add some protein. Um, I really like that. I grabbed the cauliflower of many colors. Aren't these cute? I'm obsessed. So I think I'm just going to do some salmon and cauliflower. Um, for dinner this week. Pretty boring, but you know, just getting this stuff at Trader Joe's just makes me more likely to eat it. I don't know if it's because it's cute and colorful, but I'm just gonna roll with it because I will eat it. I got the fancy shredded Mexican cheese. Again, that is for tonight's dinner, so I'm gonna throw that over here. Move it over. Um, just some grilled chicken. I put this on top of the salads that I showed you. This is a new item. This is the ricotta ravioli and it's pink. I think it's so cute. So I'm probably gonna do something for Valentine's Day um, with this ravioli, I think is what's my plan for it. So again, I'll keep it over there. Kind of a basic item, cucumber. <laughs> this pizza dough that I just keep on deck I have it at all times. Um, I usually grab one every time I go to Trader Joe's just so I have it. I absolutely love it. Um, the guy at Trader Joe's said that he makes breadsticks with this and we'll put like a little olive oil and cheese and just use like half the dough and make breadsticks when he doesn't want to make a full pizza. I thought that was super smart. Like how do the people at <laughs> Trader Joe's know all the things? I got the everything but the bagel seasoned smoked salmon. This is again for like breakfast um, items. I'm gonna make like a salmon and cream cheese bagel that you'll see in a little bit. Some pomegranate seeds. Um, I'm gonna put this again on a salad. During the week, a lot of people ask me like what I eat for lunch and it's mostly always salads. <laughs> it's kind of boring, but it's just easy and what I like to do. Um, I also got these, they're golden berries. I don't know if there's another um, name for them. David and I have had them um, at like a local restaurant that we like to eat at that's farm to table and we love them. And I think that's what these are. So I grabbed these as well. I got a couple um, Valentine's Day cards. This one says Pugs and Kisses. It just says and, ha and Valentine's Day wishes cute little card sour cream that is for tonight's dinner this is the onion and chive cream cheese spread another favorite again that's for my um, smoked salmon bagels then how cute is this you guys are gonna love it 
It's a chocolate mousse cake. Hopefully you can see it better. Shaped like a heart. I just think it's so adorable. So I also scooped up that as well. So this is all of the refrigerated items. Next are freezer items. All right, so for the freezer items, actually not that much. I thought there was more, but apparently there's not. So I'll start with the thing I get every single Trader Joe's trip is the Mexican style roasted corn. One of my absolute just favorite items. I'll be making that with our dinner tonight. Um, I also have never seen these before. I'm assuming this is a new item. This is the seasoned corn ribs. I'm gonna put that on the elote um, salad that I got. I thought it'd be really yummy. And then I also got this vegetarian meatless cheeseburger pizza. This could be truly disgusting. It could be good. You never know how these kind of things go. I, um, I'm not a vegetarian, I'm not vegan, um, but I do really enjoy plant-based food. So we will see about this. This could be good, could be bad. Another one of my favorite items is the egg frittata. Absolutely love this as a breakfast item. I usually will like just cook up a couple of pieces of turkey bacon um, with one little frittata and it's perfect. This is back for the season. The French onion macaroni and cheese. Again, absolutely love this item, so good. Sometimes I'll just make it for lunch. I don't normally do like a full meal with this, but it's delicious. I'm surprised that they still had these. Um, the turkey breast tenderloins, um, really good. Just easy, easy meal. The Spanish style rice is also for tonight's dinner. So a couple of items here for the freezer. Next is all of the non-frozen or refrigerated items. Okay, so now moving on to all of the non-refrigerated and freezer items. I picked up these tulips and these like new to me kind of flower. I don't remember what they're called or you can even set it on the packaging, but I just kind of threw together a little bouquet with some very like pink fun flowers and those white little flowers. I don't even really know what they are. Um, I'm gonna make a care package at this end of the video. Send it to David, who's currently deployed. So I got the peanut saute noodles, red curry noodles, a red onion, a um, couple of avocados. David's only getting this because we have to send like non-perishables. He's also getting a Cinnabon inspired kettle popcorn, ghost pepper potato chips. Um, the Thai lime and chili cashews are also for him. Um, the pistachio nuts and the candied pecans, those are for me for salads. Again, just to add. Um, he's also getting the everything but the bagel nut duo. These car like low carb tortillas are for dinner tonight. I picked up the dogs. This um, sweet cream flavored dental stick, so they're getting those. I grabbed some enchilada sauce. I always keep a couple of these in stock. If you've watched my videos before, I'm almost always picking these up. I got the furikake Japanese seasoning. Oops. These are new to me. David's getting some of these too. The squiggly noodles with soy and sesame sauce. Again, like another kind of like ramen meal. Um, but David is getting these too and I got some for me as well. Continuing on, I just got some alkaline water, some ranch, buffalo jerky. Again, that's going to David. There's a couple new items, the firming body butter. I'm really excited to try this. Peppermint hot chocolate. Again, another absolute favorite. I got the Moki cake mix. Cannot wait to try this. This my sister bought it um, as well, and I think she made it drizzled like caramel sauce on top of it. Sounds delicious. I got the sparkling pomegranate punch, the pesto um, rosa. This is the tomato-based pesto sauce. I am really excited about this one too. I just add this again into the TikTok pasta. I like a really kind of like saucy pasta. Um, sometimes the TikTok pasta to me is too like thick. So I like to add more flavor and really enjoy this. Taco seasoning mix. This is a new to me item. 
the retinol night serum. Can't wait to try that. A couple other David items here. Um, this is jalapeno beef jerky. Whole artichoke hearts, also for TikTok pasta. Um, I got David the spicy miso ramen soup. Uh, this is just a normal miso. Um, this is a new item. The reef and beef <laughs> dog treats. I also got them just the salmon skin dog treats. They also just love those. Um, and then the plain bagels for my salmon bagels that I told you about. And that is really everything. And I'm gonna start um, packaging up David some items. So stay tuned for that. All right, so this is everything that I have inside David's package so far. I also am gonna throw in these um, tuna packets. So those are gonna go here on the bottom. I also grabbed this, this is from Target, the spicy chicken and, and sausage gumbo. Just like throwing this all in here. I think there's gum too that I got them. I can really add a lot to this. I'm gonna keep pushing through. Gum I'm gonna throw in there. Let's see if these chips fit on the top. Sorry if I made you guys sick with that. Chips. Yes. Yeah, there's definitely some more room in here. Let me see what else I can find for him. It's a good little package. I actually have a lot more room in this box than I expected. Like there's still room for more stuff here. So I'm definitely going to go back to really any grocery store to pick him up some more items because I can just throw it in here, which is really nice. And then this it all closes, so I can definitely add more in here. So more goodies for David. Um, before I end this video, I'm just going to show you the um, chicken that I'm making um, for dinner tonight. I'm going to do like I think like chicken quesadillas, but again, I also use the chicken throughout the week for the like salads and whatnot, so more stuff to come. So this is my super easy crock pot meal that I wanted to share with you. I do Trader Joe's taco seasoning. I use a half. Um, I only have three chicken breasts in here, so I just use a half of the taco seasoning mix. I do some queso, a whole jar, and then a whole jar of salsa. Then put it in the crock pot. I do like frozen chicken breasts. And then I can make quesadillas and salads and all sorts of yummy stuff um, with the chicken. So I shred it and it will be delicious. This crock pot is from Target's like hearth and hand collection. I'll link that um, if they still have it in the description box below.